Okay, I got the head off of the driver's side. Yeah, that would be five, six, seven, eight. Sorry about the camera, it's like all fogged up and jacked. All the centers look okay except for this one right here, which is number six, and it's got a little bit of crud built up on it. So, I don't know about the intake. Looks like I had plenty of water in there. I'm gonna try a Christmas tree hone. See if I can break it up. It looks like just a rust. Hopefully it's just good enough to still run. I doubt it. But you have to hey, give it a shot, right? So that's what it looks like. The rest of them don't look too bad. But uh Yeah, it looks bad. I mean it was built. It's got some looks like domed pistons on it, which I think is an upgrade. I don't know. It's an EAC engine, so anyway. Not that exciting, but kind of exciting that now it actually turns. Pistons move up and down until it reaches that bad spot in number six. So, you got the hay. Okay, it's been about, I don't know, a couple hours. Um, still crappy video quality here. Anyway, went down and got a glaze breaking hone. I break, broke the glaze on this thing and it's actually pretty smooth compared to what it was but piston goes up and down the thing does a whole nice 360 I do have an issue with the with the valve right there which I do believe is an intake maybe exhaust no, I mean I think it's exhaust anyway it's uh I gotta take the what they call the valve cover, intake manifold off, and uh, I'll pop that valve out, probably both of them, the intake and exhaust, you know, that one's small, it's the exhaust one. Pop them both out and uh, clean them up, lappy lappy, stick it all back together and see if it'll run. Anyway, update, see ya.